Hey, it's Amanda here. Um, just making a video touching back on how I deal with anger. The last time I made a video regarding that topic was over the summer. So obviously things have changed since then. Um, the pandemic has not really loosened up. And uh, I think everyone's been dealing with a lot of tension and stress regardless of who you are and what your ailments or struggles are in life. Um, but how I deal with the anger in today's day, I, um, if that makes sense, today, now. <laughs> um, I have learned that most people are talking from you know their point of view and what they're feeling and they could be looking for a reaction from you so if you notice that and it's something that you don't feel good about that they're saying a you know a different opinion than your own they might just be looking for a reaction from you so you have to Take note of that. Be conscious of your thoughts. Think, hey, do I? I don't have to react to this person. I don't even have to talk about whatever they're talking about or whatever they're trying to trigger in me. So, just remember that. Be conscious of. Uh, just know. Keep that in your mind. People are just usually looking for a reaction from someone else. So also. Um, Another way is, I mean, everyone does this, the deep breathing, and uh, some other things I've came across is that in regards to, it's okay, honey, oh, my little one's crying, it's okay, she gets a little fussy when she's tired. Um, yeah, another thing that has, that I've learned that's helped me is, um, in regards to relationships, um, uh, you, we go into these relationships with someone, like say like a loving, a uh, boyfriend, girlfriend relationship or a marriage or whatever it may be. And we, we have this deep within us and our subconscious that we expect that partner or person to validate our feelings or heal us from past hurts that we bring from our childhood. And that's something that's good to look into. So if you're having issues with a spouse or a boyfriend or girlfriend, maybe think, why am I feeling this way? Is, could this relate back to something from my childhood that I'm expecting this partner to heal for me? And then you can figure out what that may be and together you guys can work on it and know what to give each other that would make you both happy. I think this video has been a little confusing, but maybe it could help someone. I'm not really sure. I hope so. Everyone have a blessed Wednesday and happy inauguration day. Um, I'll keep praying for the world and world peace. Amen. <laughs> Goodbye. So long.